Do you want Beast on your team like Khalil Mack and Saquon Barkley, but you don't have the coins to afford them? Make sure to hit up the coin store, man. Yes, link will be down in the description below. Make sure that you tell them that I sent you and get 10% off your first order. Yo, what's going on, my psychedelic squad? It's your boy Trippy here coming at you with something that I think could be a, a wee bit, I'm not gonna say sure proof, but it damn sure has the potential to be pretty fire. So, with all of this newness going on with Series 6, the new Series Master, the new sets that's going on, as you see my Justin Pugh just sold, um, I was going through and I was trying to find out the best value for you know draft picks, the new currency that's in the game, but like as I did that, I stumbled upon something that's actually pretty crazy. And that is a really good filter to make coins. So before we get started, just want to reiterate that I have a goal to reach a thousand subs by May 1st. And honestly, I think it's obtainable. Like I said in my previous videos, I just got to make sure I put in the work. So if you're watching, make sure you go ahead, drop the sub down below, man. It'll help out tremendously. And on my end of the bargain, it can't just be a, a, a given, a give, 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 give. And you know you don't get anything in return right i'm gonna give you really good content i I'm, i promise you this between my edits getting better between me you know getting less i'm not gonna say camera shot necessarily but you get to see this beautiful mug yeah you get to see this beautiful mug tomorrow be all <laughs> I'm going to give you the best Madden content I, I can until I just get tired of Madden for the year and either wait for Madden 20 or just give you other games in the, you know, in the process. So I got some gameplays coming your way. I got a lot of things going on, some giveaways, all that good stuff. So if you're interested in giveaways, make sure you follow Twitter down below. I got a bunch of that going on right there. Now that I got my shameless plugs out of the way, let's go ahead and get into these filters, right? All right. So you're probably thinking it's going to be like all offense, all this. No. This isn't a typical one because it's so basic. With all this new stuff coming out, get the new NFL path to the draft going on. Hit that bad boy right there. And you see Marcus Davenport. My man's going for 8K. Go a little farther down. You got Corey Coleman, 9K. You got Corey Coleman, 10K, right? You got, well, that's about the, his going rate, Terrell Edmonds, for 13K. You got Marcus Davenport down here. Get it? Oh, that doesn't count. You got Jameis Winston going for 27K. You got him going for about 30K. Watch this going rate, if I'm not mistaken. And then you keep you keep scrolling down a little bit more. You got Justin Pugh going for 50. You got Kenny Clark going for 99. You got Travis Frederick going for a buck 79. See, but a lot of these cards, they're actually not, um, you know, there's not an abundance of them. So a lot of these cards are actually going for the going rate. But the main one I wanted to get into, and yes, this could be very... I'm not going to say necessarily time consuming, but it's definitely profitable. So you see how Marcus Davenport is going for 8K. And he was just bought. Hit the quality. Hit this filter. Boom. You go to 84 to 85s, 7K. I've seen them as low as 5,500 coins. So go ahead and snipe these cards up. I would not get Marcus Davenport unless he's in that 6K range. I just bought. Matter of fact, I'm going to buy this Corey Coleman, right? And I'm going to post him literally right back up for about 10K. So I just bought him. As you see, my Barkevious Mingo just sold. So I invested all 500,000 of my coins into doing things like this. You see Corey Coleman, boom, going for 4,000. Oh, you almost had it. Thousand, right? Ah, somebody just sniped them. Somebody just sniped them. So if you can get them for like that price range, cause they're just throwing them up here at, the, at this moment, man. Get them for about that. If as low as possible, so like that 55 to 6k, and then you just keep posting them back up there for 8k. Corey Coleman will probably sell for about 10k uh, right now, and then you'll just keep making these coins. It might take a little bit of time, but like once you get the hang of it, like it's it's not gonna take the time at all. So let's go ahead and check the 86 overall market to see. Oh wow, I actually buy this. And then I'm gonna post him back up here for about 13, 14K. So like a lot of people, when they come up here, they don't check the price of these cards by like extra filters, by overalls. They just check the promotion and then they just keep, you know, uh, going through that, that filter itself. When in all reality, you need to check all of these things. You need to go really in depth or you're gonna miss snipes. You're gonna miss deals and you're not, you're, you're just gonna be wasting coins at that point. And I'm here to let you know that is stupid as hell. 
as we got another Corey Coleman going for about 6K, which is crazy because he's going for less than what Marcus Davenport is going for. We're going to go ahead and post him up here. Uh, we'll actually do 9K. We'll do 9K, see if he sells a little quicker uh, as far as like getting on the actual um, auction block, as far as like actually getting on this filter right here. So you see him going for that. You see him going for 9K. You see him going for 10K. You see him going for 11. They're going to sell. If they don't sell now, they'll sell eventually. So I was making sure that you guys know that this is going to be a pretty decent way of making coins. And I've already made, I want to say 50 to 70K profit off of what actually sold. And I found actually found a couple of snipes. Let's go ahead and even go further. Let's see 86 to 87. There's only 84, 85, 86, 88, 90, 92, 90. 4, 96, 98, and 99 overalls at the moment. And I do have a theory on how that might change pretty soon. So let's go ahead and go to the 86s. Yeah, 86. So 86. All right, we already did that. 11K. Boom. Let's go to the 88s. And the 88s. Looks like Jameis Winston going for 15K right here, right? Let's actually go ahead and go back to all. Scroll down a little bit and see what Jameis Winston's price is going for right here. 19. So 88. 19 so there's not a there's not a big discrepancy between there but you see that there are cards that are cheaper and eventually he will sell people are low-key kind of thirsty to see what these uh 84 plus packs are going for so they're trying they're getting out here trying to scrounge up as many coins as possible trying to see if there's any way possible if they can go ahead and get enough picks in order to do this but let's go ahead and go to the 90 overall as you see barkevious mingo is going for 30k let's go ahead and go to the 94s as you can see kenny clark is going for 90k which I literally just bought him for like 80 so that's a flip in itself if you can get him for about 80 then turn right back around and sell him for that you're probably not going to make too many coins off of that because the more you make the more they take um just like real life baby but travis frederick's actually going for a buck 70 let me buy him real quick i just wanted to see what he quick sells for that was the last card that i needed for my list all right so yet again just wanted to reiterate to you guys make sure that you go up here and you start hitting these filters man now they might not show up immediately that's why this is going to take a little bit longer than expected because it's so much going on in this one filter that it's going to take a while for the other ones to sell down before you can get you know uh yours to pop up on this first one so as you can see he's going for about 13k right here but he actually sells for a 11 so that's that's still 2k yet again the more you make the more you take so the lower overalls you can go ahead and get the better because it's just uh, less taxes that actually hit you and you can make a little bit more profit so if you can get this like i said again for 6k 500 5500 and then put them back up there for about 8200 you're gonna end up making all your coins back but let's go ahead and check out these 98s and 99 overalls Whew. they're dropping like flies man they were literally just about 325k they went down 30k and that's crazy because they quick sell for 46 thousand picks and i will be having a video coming up shortly after this going over the best value for picks as soon as i go ahead and get this math out of the way but i just wanted to go ahead and get this quick little coin making method that could honestly make you a pretty decent amount of coins if you you're diligent and you just you snipe it's gonna take a while this is not easy coin making methods are never fast and well sometimes they're fast but they're never easy sometimes they're easy and never fast so just wanted to throw that out there to you guys. But that'll be the end for the video, guys. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Two piece those mofos. It'll help the channel grow tremendously. Yet again, have a thousand subscriber goal by the by May 1st. Hopefully, you guys will hit the subscribe button, man. If you're here, you stay this long, you might as well hit the subscribe button, man. Subscribe. Join the psychedelic squadron with just one click of a button, man. And I guarantee that I'll give you the best content i could possibly do so and more coin making methods hopefully that can be as profitable as this one but you gotta act fast make sure that you do that stay tuned for more madden 19 content stay tuned for the best values on picks at the moment and then my overview of how this should shape out but until next time fellas peace